Hi, this is Priyanka Evangeli, your internet speech language pathologist. And in the comments, Akila had asked me how to teach my child the tense concept. So this video, I'm going to give you two speech therapy techniques to teach the past tense verbs. So the number one way is to take about five minutes every day before the child and you sleep to talk about your day. So maybe you have a bedtime routine of brushing your teeth, reading a storybook and then falling asleep. After the storybook or before the storybook, maybe take five minutes and talk about your day. Like let's say your child's name is um, Jay. What did Jay do today? And then you list down. Jay had brushed his teeth. Then he drank, drank milk. Then he ate breakfast then so you know these kind of ways you talk about the day in the past tense and you emphasize the word the past tense verb to your child so this is one something to add here is that many a times chi the child memorizes phrases like brush your teeth wash your face brush your wash your hands so they memorize these phrases which is in the present tense so they might tell you those phrases when you're talking to them that time you said yes but can you say it like this? Can you say, I brushed my teeth? I washed my hand? Because it is over. We did it earlier. Now it's finished. So you make your child understand that when you talk about past events, you, you use this form of language. The second way is using action cards. Now how to use action cards to teach past tense verbs? There are many ways you can do this. So I'll give you two examples. So let's take these uh, two action cards. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to present the first card to the child and I'm, I'm going to show it to them. And they say bathing, bathing, they say that. Then I ask, when do we bathe? Why is this child bathing? Because he played football. He's bathing because he played football and he was dirty. So he is bathing. He played football so he was dirty and so he is bathing. So you can take two, any two cards and you know make up a story around it and then ask your child for a question related to that. It doesn't have to be just why, it can be who also. And another way to do this is to take simple uh, pictures like this and let's say cooking. And then you can ask questions like who cooked your food? Who cooked breakfast? Or who cooked dinner? And then you say mommy cooked dinner. You teach this right. Again, you know, in very simple um, words like who ate food, who ate breakfast, who ate the strawberry. You can stimulate the past tense verb like this. And as you do this through structured activities, try to get your child to use the past tense verbs. Ask questions like that so that they can use the verb in real life situation. If you found this video helpful, make sure you like the and make sure you subscribe to the channel so you get more videos, upcoming videos. See you in the next video. Bye.